Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and one of my subscribers sent me a file that looked just like this. I didn't use hers because a lot of the settings she had in millimeters, and I didn't feel like messing with it. But she wanted to know how she could do this where there's a circle missing without deleting each one of these lines. And what she was doing is one way, but it's a little slow, time consuming. So just take your two point line, hold down your control key, uh, so it'll be straight, parallel. Now I draw everything in here line, so I'm gonna go through and change this to a little bit bigger, thicker line in black. And then I'm gonna go to arrange, transformation, rotate, and I'm going to rotate it 10 degrees and 18 times. So we get that. Now she's trying to get to this. So then you just draw an eclipse and hit P on the key. Well, a while ago I must have not hit P on the keyboard. So we're going to group these together real quick so it won't mess them up. Hit P on the keyboard. Now I'm going to ungroup them just so like they were. I'm going to hit P on the keyboard and I've got that circle. I'm going to go ahead and make it the same thickness as the other one and make it black. Pardon me. Make it black. So then what she was doing is control D and making a copy of that circle and then uh, putting it in the middle and then she was deleting each one of these lines and that would take a, a good bit of time so we're just going to take that circle for a second and just move that second one out of the way and because it's in the key, uh, center of the page I can move it and move it right back then all you do is just select everything and go to simplify then just delete this circle and put that circle back with the letter P on your keyboard. And you've got that uh, shape. I don't know what she's going to do with it, but it's pretty cool. And th that will save her a lot of time. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.